Hey guys, so I put all of the new star cards that I got into this binder, so I'm going to go quickly through it and kind of show you what my collection looks like now. Out of all of it, I only got 17 new cards, so I do have a bunch of the ones that I didn't have already up on my eBay account. If you want to get them, I'm selling them real cheap just because I want to get rid of them. So feel free to check out there. I'll put my uh, username down in the description as well. But here we go. I keep mine. I put them all in protective sleeves into the here. They're pretty thick, which is nice. The kind of photo card I like. And then just to make it easier, so I can quickly view which ones I'm missing and not have to look for the ones around them, or count, I put these little itty bitty cards <coughs> so I put them in these itty bitty cards with the numbers on them into these sleeves that I just pull out when I get the cards so I just find it makes it a little bit easier so I only have one sorry about the glare I can't really seem to get it to go away so I'll try and tilt it a little bit so the only card I got on the first page is number two which is an official signed um, card signed by Mark. He's one of my favorites, so I'm glad I got his. I'd say Mark and Jackson are probably my top favorites from GOT7, so I was really, really excited when I got that my first time going through. And then page two, the only new card I got was Bam Bam's, this like watercolor design, which I really, really, really like. That's why I only like a couple group star cards that I'm collecting. I got four minutes because you got the whole set when you bought a pack. I really like the looks of infinite ones. They're not just normal. They have a lot of variation, and I think some of the cards are really beautiful, which is also why I like got sevens because these ones are so nice, and it's nice that you can get like officially signed ones and things like that. So on this one, the two new cards I got was Mark Stand. And then one of these shimmer cards, I guess, of the whole group. And then here, the new card I got was, is either Mark or JB's? I think it was Mark's card. But I did get another one of JB's, of this like purpley background. <laughs> and then I have almost all of the silver signed cards. I'm just missing UVMs. I finally got, these are so common that I find these got, probably the got seven cards, but I, don't, I got a bunch of the ones and then I finally got a third from that set. Um, I got Jackson's little light card and I think you get, I got Young Jay's as well. I can't really remember 100% but I have the cards I pulled out as well. I got a couple of juniors so I'm almost done with this cool like grunge paint background which I really like. And then I got Mark's card and juniors. Got a couple extra of JB's. And then Bam Bam's. Um, I know I got a bunch of these ones. I got the group card finally. Got a couple of Bam Bams. And finally got Yu Gi -Ums. And I finished up some more of this set style. And then, of course, you get one of these and all of them. So now I have all of them. I have like a bunch of these. But. I think this contest thing is already up so it doesn't matter. I just keep them all in here. Like I have three of these. I just keep them all. And then they give you some extra sleeves. I guess in case some of these end up ripping or they get dirty and you just kind of want to replace it. Which is nice. I'm glad they gave you some extra. And then they have extra punch holes in their sleeves in case I guess you wanted to put them in a different binder in case something happened. But exactly I got... Number 63, 42, 51, 13, 66, 37, 50, 80, 62, 46, 31, 22, 56, 75, 74, 86, and 24 were the 17 new cards that I got. So the rest of the cards I got were all duplicates. 
So, but I'm happy with getting a couple bit more. Those ones on that first page are probably going to be the hardest ones to find or get since they are actually signed cards. They probably have like one out there at all. <laughs> but I'm really happy I got these. I really like their cards. I'm not sure when I'll buy another pack and kind of go through it again. But... I enjoyed it. I like these star cards. Let me know if you guys are collecting the GOT7 star cards as well and maybe which design is their, your favorite. Mine's probably like the uh, these shimmering watercolor ones are probably my favorite cards out of all of them. I only have four but that's okay. I'll get them all maybe one day. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. Like and subscribe and until the next video. Bye guys.